What's going on everyone, it's Mark here once again with another Clash of Clans video and today we have possibly the fastest 3 star on a max Town Hall 9 ever. Now you can see that we have our guy FHR attacking a pretty much max Town Hall 9, I mean his walls aren't exactly max, neither nor are his heroes, but aside from that he is pretty much maximum Town Hall 9. And so he's going to start off with just pretty much like a go white t um, style of attack, um, well not go white but like go wheat, go whatever with uh, Valkyries. And the Valkyrie's a really smart idea because he it's sort of like a southern teaser base, and so um, those Valkyries can get in between buildings and take out two buildings at once. And then he's going to go from the top, and he's going to place Hog Riders and Giants. The Giants will distract the defenses while the Hog Riders go in, so it's sort of like a surgical Hog Rider attack. And as you can see, he just obliterates his base. All that's left really is two Teslas and a cannon, and he's pretty much already beaten the base. And 20 seconds left, and the base or the attack took one minute, which is absolutely incredible. And that includes like CC, Lur, and all that stuff, and he destroyed his base in a minute. So absolutely insane attack. If you want to ever learn how to do an attack, just look at this video and you'll know. And But absolutely insane. So great job, FHR. And now here we have the next attack, Wariatu going in on their number 10 players here from the clan Serbian gang. And this force is another pretty fast attack. You can see he does it in pretty much two minutes and he's doing a hog rider attack as well so he's gonna start off of course with placing his golem and his heroes and his, the goal of this of like this beginning of the attack is to take out the clan castle the queen and trigger any double giant bomb locations that there might be but of course there are not are, there are none in this base because you can see in the core there are teslas so it's pretty safe to assume that there's no double giant bomb locations anywhere unless they're on the outside of the base so he his kill squad and his heroes and his golem have pretty much done their job at this point. So now he's going to place two giants at the top and then place his hog riders to um, take out all the defenses. The giants were pretty much used as a beginning tank while the hog riders could not attack since of course the hog riders would not be able, or since the giants would not be able to get into the walls. So the hog riders then of course go in and he's pretty much using only three spells for this entire attack since the jump spell is sort of like wall breakers I guess you could call them. And the heal spells, of course, are for the Hog Riders. And so he places his last heal spell right under the Wizard Tower, which is a really smart decision, since the Wizard Tower, of course, does splash damage. And then his Hog Riders are going to move to the Expo while his Queen is still alive. His King did die, but of course, it is already pretty much a three star attack. And there you can have it three star attack in two minutes. So, of course, another fantastic attack, absolutely amazing. And now we're just going to pretty much go on to clean up and just absolutely phenomenal so great job Wario 2 attacking their number 10 player for the win. The next attack we have is our boy Carp82 going in on Zegru from Serbian Gang and he's going on another pretty much max Town Hall 9 of course the walls are not max neither are the heroes but he's gonna start off with luring the clan castle which is a little bit odd for these type of attacks since um, it's a lot of time it comes down to time but Carp obviously knows what he's doing so he's going to lure the clan castle to the very bottom, and then he's going to place his kill squad, which is two witches, eight wizards, um, maybe the barbarian and archer, and the golem and heroes. And those will take out the clan castle, take out what we can see from here, the king, which is usually not a necessity, but in this stack he chooses to, since it is in line with the queen. And he will also, of course, take out the queen, which is a huge problem for hog riders. And so he's going to place his jump spell, so he's only going to have pretty much three heal spells for his entire attack. Um, for his hog riders. So now he's just busting through the wall. For some reason his king, all right, there we go. She, the king is gonna go in, take out the arch tower, and then he's gonna move in and rush to the queen and take out the queen, of course. And so pretty much at this point, the king is now into the center where the queen is. And since his AI does lock onto the queen rather than defenses, he's gonna go in, rush, and he's gonna press his ability as soon as the queen goes and as soon as he logs onto the queen and then he's going to pretty much start his surgical hog attack from here places one giant few hog riders more hog riders and he's going to save some giants probably for the top i'm not quite sure and he does place his heal spell and the hog riders are going to move in and i believe he places the rest of his hog riders towards the top to try and um close onto the base yes you can see here he places the next of his giants and the rest of his hog riders and that'll pretty much wrap up the three star already. There is an expo left, but he still has his giant seven hog riders and a heal spell left. And I believe his queen is still alive. If not, uh, then I don't even know. But regardless, he places his last heal spell. And now it is definitely a three star attack. 
and just another phenomenal attack. Um, hog riders are very strong if you know how to use them in this game. I do not know how to use them at all. I think they're difficult, but I also have level 1 hog riders and I've never tried. So um, I mostly do go wipe with loons in the back. Well, go wee wee with loons in the back. And so, yep, that's pretty much all for this attack and all for this video. So I hope you guys did enjoy. Please subscribe and like the video if you did. And have a great day, guys. Bye-bye.